thank you for watching this uh, tutorial video uh, this tutorial video is brought to you by newqbo.com newqbo.com your one-stop QuickBooks online learn and share blog and uh, uh, if you go to uh, uh, into uh, community uh, you will see me here too right here DP controller and I'm on uh, all-time uh, leader here okay so this video I'm gonna focus on way to pay vendor bills originating from your purchase order via a credit card okay this is uh, QuickBooks Online homepage and I'm gonna create a purchase order I've already created one here okay here's one here as you can see I have a, a account details section as well as item detail this is for inventory site uh, so I just want to cover both uh, you know you need plus plan you, you want to have uh, inventory uh, feature okay so I've created already one here uh, purchase order I'm going to create another one uh, I'm just going to copy this okay uh, 1250 and I'm just going to make this a little bit different amount okay so let's say this is 1350 the other one is 1250 so I'm going to save this one I'm gonna close it okay so now uh, I'm gonna pay one by credit card right away okay so you have you gotta select this credit card in here so I'm gonna select uh, uh, I have a bunch of credit cards in here uh, this is a demo file I'm just gonna create a uh, choose chase credit card and I'm gonna select a uh, uh, supplier you know in this case uh, supplier is vendor uh, a1 supplier as you can see here the moment you select a1 supplier uh, the draw will open on the right side so I'm gonna select this one the first one for 1250 so I'm gonna just uh, pay right away uh, uh, using chase credit card okay so this is chase credit card and I'm gonna save it okay this is 1250 so it's basically already uh, you already use credit card and uh, you already recorded in QuickBooks now uh, so save and close I'm gonna close this one okay so that's one way pretty easy uh, the other one uh, I'm gonna enter that bill at this point I don't know I'm gonna write a check or uh, or how I'm gonna pay I don't know so I'm just gonna enter it as bill and pay it later okay here's the second one just add this save and close okay so you you, you already uh, entered both the transfer from basically from purchase order to uh, paid one and other one enter as uh, uh, bill right here the bill and as the other one you already paid it uh, using credit card so the second one uh, you know at this point when you enter bill you, you know you, you, you have no idea how you're gonna pay it so later on you decide well I'm gonna pay it uh, and I'm just gonna use credit card again the second one the so select a1 I just supply it right here 1350 and in here payment account you need to select your credit card account here chase credit card all right or whatever credit card you have on your list you you, you know the credit card at the bottom in here but you can select credit card in here it's the credit card type select credit card uh, and amount is thirteen fifty and basically you know the payment account is credit card it comes out from your uh, credit card account and then just uh, basically save it it's done so both credit card but one directly uh, entering as credit card the one uh, entering as bill and paid later using credit card well that's simple so anyway uh, subscribe to our YouTube channels we have two channels VP controller new QBO and also like us on Facebook thank you again bye